first. Oh, we are? Well, I am. Oh, well, you look at it. I'll say this is my grandma. Yeah. Okay, you gonna start? <laughs> okay, everybody, this is, this is my grandma, and she has agreed to start learning how to play the piano. She's never played before in her life, and how old are you, Grandma, if you want to say? 88. She's 88, and we're going to let you join us on this piano lesson adventure, and we're going to come visit Grandma every week and film our lessons. So we're going to go ahead and get started. Do you want to say anything, Grandma? No. No? I don't okay. Think so. Okay. <laughs> okay, so have you seen my books before? No. Okay, this is my first book, and um, book one, and it um, starts out with just explaining about the piano. I'm just going to find um, a page here where it talks about the groups of two and three black keys. Mm -hmm. The piano is divided into white keys and black keys, that's obvious, but some people don't notice that the black yeah, keys are in groups of twos and threes. Yeah, I, I really didn't notice until you said that, that they're in threes and twos. Really? You didn't yeah, notice? No. Okay. Well, I haven't really looked at it, but until you said it, I hadn't noticed. Okay, so that's how you're going to find your white keys, by finding a group of two or a group of three black keys. So now, when you look at the piano, it's not so overwhelming because you know that I'm going to tell you that next to every group of two black keys is a, is a white key called C. They're all C's? They're all C's. Next to all the groups of two black keys. Yeah, maybe on this side? No. No, just on the left. Just on the left. So on the left of all the groups of two black keys is a C. Go ahead. Go ahead and find them. Well, they're starting right here. The groups of two only, not not next, oh, not well, the groups yeah, of three. I, I messed up on that. One. Okay. Good. <laughs> <laughs> we should be looking at the camera, though. How can you look at the camera when you're looking at the keys? I don't know. You can. Okay. Well, that was okay. That was good, Grandma. Now was that a picture? Did you, did you picture that? Did you take a picture of that? Yes. We're on camera. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> you may want to throw the first ones away. Uh, maybe. I'll look at them. <laughs> okay, so we, we went through finding C already. Uh -huh. Next to the two black keys. Next to the two black keys is C. Right. Middle C, you've probably heard of, heard that. Refer, heard heard middle C. You've heard of middle C? So it would be between them? No. <laughs> That's the middle. No. <laughs> middle C is the C closest to the middle of the piano. So it's still on the left of the two black keys. Oh, okay. But middle C is the C closest to the middle. Can you can you see uh, our face? Okay. Well, hopefully we're loud enough for the cameras picking us up. Okay. So middle C is the one closest to the middle. Okay, so you have several C's. You have several C's, but the middle one is closest to you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, well, is there two of these or just one? There's one middle C. Just one middle C. Right. There's several C's. Yeah, I just found them but after the two black ones. Right. Right. And Jay is over there dancing, Grandma. And then. <laughs> and then the middle C is here. Right. Okay, and that's where you're going to start playing, is on middle C, with your right hand. Oh, with my right hand. With your right hand. So, look at this page, it says finger numbers, and it numbers your fingers, one, two, three, four, five, starting with your thumb. Right. So if you put your thumb on C, all of your other fingers will naturally fall on a key. Don't skip any keys. Oh, don't skip any Don't key. skip any keys. Right. So that's middle C position. All of that middle C position. Okay. Yep. Okay. Now what you're going to do, if you, can you see this? When you see the C, you're going to play a C. Mm -hmm. So go ahead and play practice number one on page 18. And don't look at your fingers because they're in position. They're in position. And you're going to look here. Got it? Mm -hmm. Okay. Got, is that middle C? Yes. Oh, okay. C. 
Don't, don't look at your fingers, Grandma. See? And then number two finger. Three, four, five, five, five. Okay, and then now let's move to practice number two. Okay. Twice. Uh-huh. C. What's two? Your second finger. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Three. Four. Five. Right. Okay, so these are your fingers, oh. except for C is your, is your number one yeah. finger. So we don't have a number one there, we just have a C. Okay. Got it? Got so it. this will be one of your practice pages for this week. Can I practice? Yeah, I, what am I yes, going I'm, I'm going to leave the keyboard here. <gasps> you are? Mm -hmm. Oh, I have fun. Um, and I'm going to leave the book here, and I'll give you assignments. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> so uh, I don't have a pen with me, but I'm going to mark this page where you're going to practice. Yeah, I'll, I'll need a lot of practice. And okay. you have to keep your eyes on the paper. And not on your hands. Right. You have, that, you have to get that feeling. Mm-hmm. Because it's hard to get that feeling when you don't, you know. you're not used to it. Yeah. Yeah. I, I, is the seat okay for you? It's high enough? Oh, yeah. Okay. So there's a just, you know, now that you have that it's position, this page and this page, 19 and 20, are the same thing. And that's going to be the end of our lesson, but let's go through it right now. Up here, it says eyes on music, very important rule. So just so you keep that in mind while you're playing these. So go ahead and start here again with C, two, three, four, okay? Right. It, it feels a little awkward mm -hmm. right now, but it'll feel it'll smoother more natural. as you practice each day. Just go through it a couple times each day. Okay. Okay. Our last page for today is page 20. And it's a little longer. You start with three. Mm -hmm. I have to figure out my fingers there. Three. Oh, three. Okay, I, I messed up. I'm going to start over, can I? Yes, you can. Three. It's hard for me to figure out. Right, your brain has to yeah. know which finger to move without yeah. looking at it. Yeah, <laughs> you have to use all that. You do. Okay, so when after you've practiced it throughout the week, it should be it should sound a little smoother, like this. I'll show you. I'll play page twenty. You know which number? Yes. That, that's what could, I have to stop and think which is three and which is four. I know. Until I get, yeah. But after a while, you won't have to think about it anymore. Just it. It'll just be natural. Okay. It, it isn't very pretty yet. The song isn't very pretty, but uh -huh. it still helps you get going. We're going to get into pretty songs later. After you move your fingers a little bit yeah, better. Then you have to learn your fingers, you know, where they are. Mm hmm. I have to stop. That's what I can do. I have to stop and think. I can't be smooth and go ahead and do it all at once because I'm thinking, where is that third finger? Right. Right. At first, it's all thinking and rough, and then after the thinking goes away, then it gets smooth. Yes, it gets smashed. Yes. Yeah. Okay, so let's say goodbye. All right, this is the end of the first. Goodbye. The end of the first lesson. <laughs> <laughs> See you next time. See you next time. <laughs>